Chris Froome, 2017, 2016, 2015, and 2013 Tour de France champion. He lines up as favourite, in my opinion. He did win the Giro this year, so he might be a little bit tired, but he's just got the best team here, uh, for sure. He's a solid climber, solid time trialist. He should do all right in the cobble stages, so I really think Chris Froome, uh, his, his form's been pretty bad until the Giro, but the Giro, he really had some finish that off with some good form. So he's definitely uh, my favorite for the Tour de France GC at this moment in time. Next up, we have Vincenzo Nibali, 2014 Tour de France champion. He's also won the Giro twice and the Vuelta Espana. He does really, really well on these cobbled stages, as you can see in this moment. In this picture here, he finished uh, top three, I think it was on the stage. Um, so I think he'll definitely get some time there. Team time trial will be interesting, but there's one thing with Vincenzo Nibali. Even though his form has been pretty bad so far, he always just is so good at bringing it out the bag. So I think Nibali, Probably get on the podium, I think probably a second place for the young Nibs, uh, for the old Nibs actually. Uh, he's a real good, just solid bloke who just know, is like always turns up to a grand tour in good condition. So I'm excited to see what he can do. The next on my podium, I believe is going to be Nairo Quintana. Although it doesn't really suit him, there's a team time trial, which I think, to be fair, his team is very strong in the team trial, which will suit him. Cobble's not too good, but he does enjoy the cobble, so I feel like he, he shouldn't lose too much time on that stage. And he's just a solid climber. Time trial, he'll lose a bit of time, but not that much. He just knows what the job is. I feel like He's on good form this year. He looks real solid in the Tour de Suisse. Uh, I think, I just really do think that this year, Nairo Quintana is going to kick on, uh, get that podium spot. Will he win it? I just don't think so, because I think there are stronger uh, alternatives like Nibali and Froome. Uh, but I think he should be able to definitely get at least on the podium. Uh, and I think it's going to be a pretty exciting race because if he's a little bit down, I mean, Quintana wants to win, so he could launch some real big attacks. Uh, so yeah, it's going to be exciting to see where Quintana finishes on the podium. All right, I've missed some riders, so Adam Yates, I think he's going to have a real solid tour. Will he be able to get on the podium? I think it's just going to depend on the time trial. Um, team time trial on cobble stages, he should do well. Bardet, uh, I just I just don't really think, I think the team time trial, he won't have the best team. He does have a solid team, Nason, Gallopin, they're all good, but for me, I don't think he'll be able to... Um, like regain that time plus the time trial himself he's going to lose time i think the cobbles he'll probably lose time um so i don't really think that barde is going to come on the podium this year i think it's a it's a bold prediction because to be honest barde has come on the podium for the last two years but i mean he was pretty lucky to get on it last time it was just because landed couldn't really um well he was working for Froome. uh and then the other is richie port and for me i just think richie port He's just going to have some bad luck. I really hope it's this year, but I just, he's one of the best climbers, but best time trial, one of the best time trialists. But for me, the team time trial, he'll do well, he might even gain time, but I just think the cobbled stages or like in the top, in one of the mountain stages, he'll just have some bad luck. Um, and I don't think he'll be able to come on the podium. Maybe I'll be wrong. I probably will be, but these are my predictions for the GC. Sprints will be out tomorrow. What are your predictions? Do you think Chris Rimmer won? Do you think Quintana will get on the podium? Do you think someone like I haven't even mentioned, like maybe Uran might suddenly bang out a good one? Micah, I mean, there's so many. Zacharine, will they suddenly, Zacharine, get on the podium after his podium in the Vuelta? No one really knows, but it's all going to be good. And maybe Tommy D might just come back from the Giro and be like, right, boys, I'm going to dominate the cobbles, dominate the time trial, dominate the team time trial, and hang on on the climbs. It's also going to be a very exciting Tour de France. So anyway, cheers for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.